I had a hard enough time fighting an eight foot tall guy when he had skin. What's up guys and welcome back to Gorn and for today's episode we finally have mods for this game like this is something that I'm really excited for you guys know that I love user generated content and I'm not sure how many of them I'm gonna get to cover because I'll mention right now they do kind of break the game and make things difficult to record but I really couldn't resist this one. Oh my god. So today, we're looking at the skeleton mod, and I've only seen screenshots, I haven't played this yet. But seeing it firsthand is just amazing, look at you! And the beauty of it is, they're not people, right? They're just spooky scary skeletons, so I can just beat the undying turds out of you, and nobody can get mad at me, right? You're not bleeding much, so don't worry about it. I don't even want to fight you. Like, I, I just want to observe. <laughs> like, what are you trying to hit me with right now? You don't have a fist. You're just trying to hit me with your wrist bone. I like the fact that they're also still wearing their armor. So, ow, okay, wrist bone still kind of hurts. That was very rude. <laughs> wonder if we can get into that rib cage. What happens if I, uh, see if we go right down the middle. I don't have very good weapons for this. I'm using blunt force weapons, which are used for armor. And surprisingly, these guys are rigid. Like, I kind of expected whoever made this just kind of removed the texture for their skin so that all you have is the bones left, but it really does feel like I'm whacking on a skeleton. That is exactly what I need. Thank you very much, sir. We're just gonna get rid of those and, oh, come back to me. Yes, you're home. Don't worry. Everything is gonna be fine. <laughs> well, aren't you overcompensating? Listen, I know I took your skin, but you really didn't need to take all the shields. I love their eyes, too. The fact that if you hit them, you can see them just kind of go all wonky. And I think if I hit them hard enough, yeah, they get really big for a split second. You got way too much armor. There we go. You see? Isn't that better? Can I pick you up, I wonder? Do I have anybody sneaking up? I do have somebody sneaking up behind me. You wait over there. I want to see what this guy's... <laughs> that is just... Amazing. Just the simplest things that you could do in this game amuse me so much. I wish that this worked for the champions because I was kind of planning on making this episode be all about the champion skeletons, but I think it only works with the, well, the, the peons, with these little guys. So if this is going to be a peon-based episode, what I'm thinking is I want that. I want to start off with this complete madness like we were using last time because I had a lot of fun kind of breaking this. I think I can break it further, okay? Let's see if we can break it further. If I take this, and I take this, and I just start kind of swinging this around like a madman. There we go. Okay, oh, whoa, 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 sorry, didn't see you there. Oh, oh, there we go. Yep, now we're getting some momentum behind it. That makes a whole lot of sense. It's gonna hit you eventually, okay? You can't avoid it forever. At some point, there it is. Oh, God. I love this thing. I want to get a better look at it, like to show you guys, but it's really difficult because it's kind of everywhere at once. Oh, 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 oh. I might be out of gas. Hold on a second, sir. Whoa, whoa, big boy. Ow, that really hurts. Not as much as that, though. You skeleton guys have no idea how tiring this is on the arms. <laughs> I just have to look at them and kind of hope that they get hit. That, that's really all that's happening right now. I have no aim, I have no control, I have no sweet clue what's going on. I'm just kind of praying that I hit a uh, little bit of any- I thought that was like some kind of weird skeleton dog. Okay, you know what? My arms are tired. Maybe we should try a fist fight. I haven't done that in a while. You don't want to fist fight me. Do, uh, how about one of you? Come on, what do you got? See, oh, that guy just gave out. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, it's not really a fist fight if you don't have fists. Feel, ow, okay, I see how it is. He, he, woo, ah, he got me. That wasn't very fair. Let's just, uh, <laughs> kind of pick him up and break him over my knee. <laughs> Look what I found. The one weapon left in this game that I need to get kills on to unlock some challenges. So, oh, I thought that was somebody else swinging at me. <laughs> It's my own weapon. How about we get the job done here, okay? I need to actually win. Oh, skeleton knight. Uh, 
<laughs> that might be a little difficult. It doesn't really matter if you have skin, if you're covered in armor. There we go. You just sit down. Okay, your armor's all, like, plastic. It doesn't matter to me. Yeah. Good. Get out of here. Now, you, on the other hand, good sir, you're going to be a bit of an issue. Come on. Bring it on, Ghost Rider. <laughs> you can see the eyes in the helmet. That is awesome. Oh, I love this mod. I can't wait to do more random mods with modded characters, I guess. Like... Could they change these guys into anything? I would love to fight other things. Ooh. How effective would a bow be against a skeleton? I think I have enough kills with this so we can find... Uh, we, we, we can find... Out. Ooh, okay, just gotta do a bit of a side stroke. Sorry, sorry about that. Sorry, I, I can't really see what I'm doing. This thing kind of has a mind of its own sometimes. <laughs> okay, no, I, I need I need this. I, I need this. There we go. Okay. Boop. Ooh. Still very effective. Yep, I like it. I won't pretend to know how this works, but it, it just does. <laughs> yeah, that, that totally killed you, right? <laughs> you look like some kind of demented Muppet. Oh, I needed to get flail kills to unlock the giant flail. So now I have every weapon in the game, I'm pretty sure. And a lot of people were asking me, can you hit the gong? You can. Try my best to take every opportunity to study my enemy, you know, know your enemy, know yourself kind of thing, and uh, I can't really figure out what's the point of a belt if you're not wearing pants? <laughs> or if you don't have anything to conceal, right? What are you hiding, skeleton man? Oh my god, it does work with the champions. I thought it didn't! When I was loading up the mod, it didn't, and it said in the description of the mod that it only worked for the... Eons, did you just murder your tiny skeleton friend? <laughs> okay. This changes everything. I need to face off against the skeleton champions. Okay, we're changing the episode. We'll do it on the fly. Oh, you were already terrifying as it is. <laughs> I had a hard enough time Fighting an eight foot tall guy when he had skin. Oh my god, okay, I just I need to be aggressive. Gotta be aggressive. Be be aggressive. Ah! I can't let him hit me first. Let's try that again, shall we? Except for this time, I'm not gonna let you hit me, okay? I'll, I'll avoid your tiny little toothpick of an arrow, and then we're getting in there. We just we gotta get in there right away. We gotta keep him on the we gotta keep him on the ground, right? Just just keep whacking away at him. Don't get up! Don't get up, skeleton monster! <laughs> Stay down! Oh my god, okay, yeah, you you go in there, okay? You're, you're going on vacation. Where's your... <laughs> Hello, little bucket boy! Hey, 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 that's that's really rude. Okay, I gotta get back to you. You you just stay down. I've already taken so many teeth. There. Are we good? You're not gonna be able to swing that, but uh, I might. You know what they remind me of? The Martians from Mars Attacks. <laughs> the, the buggy eyes. Okay, I'm really happy that I didn't have to smush you there. I get the feeling axing down a baby skeleton might not have gone over all that well. <laughs> Who am I kidding? You're no baby. You would have killed me at a moment's notice. You know, we gotta try everybody's favorite in Badger Man. I I'm kind of happy that the badgers aren't skeletons. That might have been a, a little too much. Right, right. Okay, they, they don't give you weapons. You only get rocks. <laughs> so you're really just a normal dude, but a skeleton with badger hands. I, I absolutely love this game. Okay, stay away from my stay away from my face. Not interested. Yeah, you go up there. <gasps> I can hit them out of the arena? I've never seen that before. That's ingenious. What if I just, uh, yeah. Hold on, J just keep trying to tennis serve them up. You wait right there, sir, okay? I gotta deal with your crazy little pets. Hold on, nah, close. It's a lot easier said than done, okay? Have you ever tried to whack a badger out of an arena? I'm hitting them off the spikes and I'm doing damage to them, but that doesn't seem to really matter. I need to go up and over. There we go, that's a home run. <laughs> it's just you and me now, big boy. Do you even do anything other than walk away from me? Like, do you throw a punch? Oh, you have a little, a little badger tail on your hat and every- Oh, you do throw punches. Good for you. Can, can we just let him go? Can we get his badgers back in here? I, I kind of feel bad. Oh, oh, no, no, I was joking. Don't actually bring the badgers back. I'm kind of happy I got rid of them. Oh, I just got to avoid 
pushing you near the <laughs> near the door too much. <laughs> thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. Uh, on the way home, be sure to keep an eye out for two little troublemakers. I'd say they might bite your balls, but I think you guys are just floating heads. Guys, I, I had to do it, okay? I couldn't resist seeing what happens when you take the guy who wears a skull on his head and then make him a skeleton. <laughs> and now you're just some kind of weird goat freak. It, it didn't help your hearing issue because he, he still has no idea. Oh, it was a vision issue, right? You can hear me perfectly fine when I call you an idiot, but he can't see anything. He's just kind of swinging aimlessly. Not having feet probably doesn't help either. Okay, hold on. Let's let's see what I can do here. I, I wouldn't mind. No, stop walking away from me. Where did you get this guy? Honestly, he doesn't seem all that interested in fighting. Oh, seeing his eyes through the skull is creepy. Maybe I can just, uh, eh, there you go. Yeah, you didn't need that, right? And then a uh, little, little of that. We good? Yeah, I think we're good now. <laughs> I keep doing this to him where I disarm him. Literally and then just toy with him and I probably don't need to again. What's with the belt if you don't have pants? Maybe I can ah, just give you a, a bit of a lift off or send you back out there. He's done is he? Okay Now obviously there are a ton of skeleton champions for me to face off against and I will okay I'll be facing off against every skeleton form because I want to see that but right now I kind of want to do something that I haven't done on camera before like, I did this in between episodes because I wanted to make a thumbnail, but I realized that every weapon that I unlock has a challenge attached to it. And it's just like a, a minute, get as many kills as you can kind of thing, but I would love to try the bow and arrow challenge against skeletons. I'm also going to need to look into the fact that there's a mod for infinite arrows. I'm pretty sure you could just summon arrows out of thin air using your hand. Right now, I only get four, which is a bit of a bummer, but I think we're going to make it work just Fine. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Really appreciate the tips for air. Oh, this. Oh my god. That was so lucky Wait, how did I knock that guy out with an arrow in the head? That doesn't make any sense. Whoa. Whoa okay, little bit close guys personal space This was my OG favorite weapon. Okay. I loved the bow. It was before like we unlocked the Claws and the, the you know the wolverines and the crabs and everything that kind of made this game over the top Back when all you had was the basic weapons, this was my jam. Now I can go from head to head. Oh, oh, popping new ones. There we go. Oh, Legolas is here. Legolas didn't fight skeletons, did he? So if anything, I'm better than Legolas, right? He's got nothing on me at that point. Can I borrow this, sir? Thank you. Oh, it's really hard to keep them off of me. They're all over the place, and I do not have enough arrows I'm getting tangled in my cords oh, hold on how much time we got left Four, 38 seconds holy crap I thought this was going for a minute already ah time just kind of slows down when you're popping off little uh, heads are they heads can you really consider this a head ow it's really more of just a, a floating eyeballs and a jaw It'd be nice if you could reload your quiver as well. Like if I could just pick up a bunch of arrows, put them all in my bow, and then rapid, oh, fire at everybody. Did I just miss? How, how, how did I miss? Oh no. I'm starting to get overwhelmed here, guys. There's too many of them. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hey, 29 headshots. Not too bad. Shall we make that an even 30? I always get so caught up checking out this guy's fat nips that I've never noticed how much of a mouth breather the gong worker is. Do you think I can surprise him? No? He's just completely out to lunch. So here's what I'm thinking. If they're gonna overwhelm me with a bunch of peons, I probably don't want a bow and arrow. I would much rather something like this. Why did they give me two? There's no way I can wield two. Well... I mean, I could try. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Screw it. I'll give it a try. <laughs> I get the feeling this is not going to end well for anybody, myself included, but let's go, guys. <laughs> Let me just... Okay, yep, this, this is gonna be difficult. Oh, dear. You get, like, no momentum behind your swing. <laughs> guys, why did I choose... Ooh, getting people behind me, though. That works. Excuse me. Oh, that tickle. Yep, that tickles. He's just kind of giving me the, the lazy eyes. Okay, you know what? Enough of that. Oh, I see how it is. You guys all want to keep your distance now that I'm taking this seriously. Well, guess what? Distance isn't your friend against this weapon. 
<laughs> Especially when you're just a pile of bones, you kind of fall apart underneath the sheer weight of it. Oh my god, this is so good. Hello, oh, sorry, sorry about that. Sorry about it. I didn't see you there. Oh man, the time slow down is great too, because then I get the like vinegar strokes in. I can finish them off and then come through. Yeah, I think this, I, I don't know, it's really hard to tell what's my favorite weapon in this game. Like, I know I keep saying that this is it, and then this is it, and I'm all over the place. I have a lot of favorites, but man, oh man, there's just something about <laughs> sweeping the upper body off of somebody and then cutting off their legs at the end. It's just satisfying. What if I try the blunt side a little bit? Yeah, there we go. You see, I don't need to be too aggressive with these guys. We can have fun here. <laughs> I just need to teach them a lesson, right? That's a paddling. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, that's a pad. Sorry about that. I, I can't really twist it. There's no real twisting motion. Oh, we're done. 29 kills again. What is it about getting 29 kills on the dot every time? You know what? I really couldn't resist doing one more champion, even if they give me a crappy little weapon and he's technically covered in armor, so who could tell that he's a skeleton? But trust me, in there somewhere, he's a skeleton. He's gonna do a, a stupid little jump at me. Come on, where's the jump? There it is. Oh, oh, okay, and is he done? Nope, not done yet. He's, he's, ow, he's working on it though. Hey, look, there's your skeleton-ness. <laughs> I knew it was in there somewhere. Uh, it's like Dark Souls, except, well, more fun. Where'd the lungs come from? Okay, you know what? Don't ask questions. You know what? I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Gorn, guys. And like I said, we still have a bunch more skeleton champions and skeleton challenges and skeleton screwing around to do. So if you guys are interested in seeing another episode with this mod, or if you have another mod that you'd like for me to check out, let me know in a comment, leave a like on the video, and I'll be sure to return again soon. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.